here with Klaus Kutcher. This is a bike I have heard about, and I have seen pictures in magazines, but to see it in person, really, the pictures don't do it justice. Tell us what we have here. It's a BMW R7. It's built as a prototype. It's in Art Deco style. The year when it was produced, it was 1934. Now, was this bike available for purchase, or was it a, a one-off? No, it's a one-off one. Yeah, well, I mean, it's very Art Deco, and it's just, it's just beautiful. It's yeah. just, what am I looking at, 500 cc? No, 800 cc. Oh, 800, that 800 was quite CC. big for 34, huh? That's right, yeah. Yeah, so that was pretty powerful. And I, of course, a hand shift here, four speed. Looks like an, a car. Right, very much so. And of course, the classic BMW shaft drive. But why did they not produce this motorcycle? This looked like it would have been something that would have... I think it was too expensive to produce this yeah, motorcycle. So. Yeah. They decided to, uh, to make the other one. Yeah, yeah, very nice. And of course, has floorboards as well. Yeah. And you get gasoline on your shoe, you gotta have that. <laughs> yeah. Wow. Is this the only one there is? This is the only one. It's wow. the one. 5,000 kilometers? Yeah, that's right. Wow. And look at look at the drum type speedometer, which was quite popular with uh, Duesenberg and some American automobiles at the, t at the period. This was also in this period in Germany available. Yes, yeah. So, well, I mean, it is quite a modern motorcycle. I mean, this is something you could almost almost make today. And can we open this side panel? Yeah, Look at how you that. get to... That's how you turn on the fuel, this. Yeah. Oh, I see, and you have, a, Some, you have something that can catch fire in there, too. So that, <laughs> that, that looks nice. It burns better. <laughs> and in that wonderful German engineering way, your electrics are all protected inside the motorcycle. Um, it's a magneto. That was always BMW's thing, that they were, when I was a kid, motorcycles were not very reliable. They just broke down and antiquated. And BMW always had the, the best electrics of, of, any, of any bike and the best waterproofing. And that's a classic example. Everything is nicely done. You turn on your gas there. What am I looking at here? Uh, that's from the gear, oh. to shift the gear. Oh, of course, of course, yes, okay. Trans into nice. the gearbox. Is there a panel on the other side as well? No. Just on, on this side. No, on this side. And look at the Art Deco fenders and the styling. So it is a hard tail, as we say in the States, yeah, yes? Yeah. And then your spring is all in the seat. Yeah, that's okay. right. Well, it's uh, just beautiful. Wow, what a wonderful piece of machine. And you brought this all the way from Germany. Yeah. Well, it's thank you so much. Thank you so yeah, much for doing that. Yeah, it is. It's, Many thanks. Beautiful, beautiful. What do we have here? Uh, this is for the um, oil temperature. Oh, okay. And the pressure. Right, right, right. Wow, wow, just fantastic. Thank you so much. Thank you so much.